Hi guys, welcome to Let's Be Foodie. Today I am going to share Khasta Moong Piyaj Kachori recipe with you, which is very crispy, flaky and flavorful. So let's have a look at the ingredients. Let's begin. First I'll prepare dough. Add 2 cups of all-purpose flour, 1 tablespoon of clarified butter, little bit of salt. Now mix thoroughly with your hand. Add little water at a time and knead medium dough. Dough is ready. Now it's time to cover the dough and let this sit for 20 minutes. I have soaked 180 grams of moong dal for 2 hours. Rinse it well and then make coarse paste as shown in the video. Cut one large onion in small cubes. Make sure it's all even. Heat oil on medium heat and deep fry onion. Once it will turn light golden brown, immediately take it out. For stuffing, add 2 tablespoons of oil in a pan on medium heat. In hot oil, add 1 teaspoon of cumin seeds, 1 teaspoon of carom seeds, 1 teaspoon of nigella seeds, 1 tablespoon of crushed coriander seeds, add some asafoetida. Quickly stir for about just 30 seconds. Add finely chopped green chili, stir well. Add 1 tablespoon of coriander powder. 1 teaspoon of fennel powder, 1 teaspoon of ginger powder, saute all the spices well, add coarse moong dal paste, mix well and keep stirring on low medium heat until it dries out. Make sure it does not stick to the bottom. Now it has started drying. So it's time to add rest of the spices. Add 1 teaspoon of Kashmiri red chilli powder, 1 teaspoon of mango powder, 1 tablespoon of garam masala, add salt to taste, again mix well and keep stirring for few more minutes. Add fried onion, give this a good mix. And cook for about 3 more minutes. Let this cool down. Stuffing is ready. In a bowl, add 2 tablespoons of clarified butter and 2 tablespoons of all-purpose flour. Mix well and keep it aside. It's been 20 minutes. Let's check dough. Give final massage. Now take medium size of dough. Make round ball and then flatten in your palms. Sprinkle all-purpose flour on clean surface and roll it into 8 inch diameter circle. Apply paste all over it evenly with your hand or brush. Fold it from one side. Apply paste. Fold it from other side. Fold it from right side and fold it from left side. Keep it in a container covered and prepare rest of them following same process. I have rolled all of them. Let me take one out and roll it again. Sprinkle all purpose flour, tap with your hand and increase the size. Now roll it in a square shape. Roll all the edges thinner than center. Make sure center is thicker than edges. Add 3 tablespoons stuffing in the center. Now join two diagonal corner first and pinch at the top. Take third corner, pinch at the top and seal both edges completely. Similarly do it for fourth corner and seal the edges properly. Now hold two diagonal corners and pinch it together. Take remaining two corners and pinch them all together. Give it a twist and press it down. Prepare rest of the kochoris in the same way. 
Heat oil in a pan on low medium heat. In hot oil add pachoris one by one. Gently flip them after a few minutes. Flip again from other side and cook until they turn golden brown from all the sides. So now it's time to take them out. It's time to check our kachori. So let me break this for you. They are super crispy and very flaky, just like puff pastry. Let me open this for you. So as you can see, there are multiple layers and entirely cooked from inside as well. You can keep these perfect crispy flaky kachoris in airtight container and it's good to go for a few days. Enjoy these kachoris as it is with tea or serve with spicy potato curry which reminds me of channi chop. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video don't forget to hit like and subscribe button now. Do try this recipe and let us know how it turned out for you by putting comments in comment section. I'll see you soon with a new recipe. Until next time, stay happy and healthy. I hope you guys enjoy this recipe as much I do. Try out my other great recipes too. If you like my recipe, subscribe today. It's free. You can also follow Let's Be Foodie on Facebook, Google Plus, Twitter and Pinterest. Thanks for watching.